Right, hello, this is our Air Swimmer review video. Um, my daughter got the Air Swimmer, the clownfish one, for Christmas this year, uh, a couple of days ago. Um, first of all, let's talk about setting it up. Let's have a look at the, here he is over here, this is the real one. You can see, flying around. Um, first thing to do, when you get out the box, is you need to blow it up. Now we blew it up with just a jar of helium that we bought. You can see there. That was about twenty-five pound for the for the helium. Uh, it says it does about fifty balloons. So I'd imagine we should be able to fill this fish up several times with that. There you go. You see him there. Um, right. After you blew him up, after we blew him up, we had to fix this thing on the bottom. Now I'm, my daughter's controlling it. I'm just gonna ask it to to um, make him go up and down. So you can see that thing move. There you go, it moves forward and backwards. Now we have to fix that, thank you. We have to fix that to the bottom of the air swimmer. And you do, do need two people to do it because it just flies away. And you can see that it's just held on with sticky, uh, double-sided sticky tape holds it on and then they put some sticky tape over the top. And it's all supplied, all the tape you need supplied. And, um, then once that's on, you need to put these hooks, put these four hooks on. There's one there, one on the top, one on the bottom, and one on the side. And those, then you need to connect the fin piece to the fin motor, which is here. And this fin, thank, thank you, do you want to give it another wiggle? There we go. And the fin motor um, is attached to the four hooks for these four elastic bands. Um, it was a bit fiddly actually getting this actual fin attached to the motor there. But um, my wife was better at that than I was. Um, after that is simply stick on the fins. There's two at the bottom there as you can see. One, two, and again, double-sided sticky tape on the thin and on the fin, and then some sticky plaster on after that. And the one on the top as well. There we go. And then, the tricky bit, we had to refill it, we didn't put enough in the first time. And what, what happened was, this bit here was bent. See that bit there, that was bent. And as a result, this wouldn't go back and forth, as it does now. There we go, and that uh, helps it go up and down by, and if, if you put it all the way up, kid. All the way, keep going, that's it. That angles the nose down, and when the nose is angled down, then if you flick the tail, all right. We're going to show you. Okay, just move that all the way back, and now she's going to flick the tail, and then it pushes itself upwards. Keep going. As you can see, there's it going upwards. All in all, it took about 25 minutes to assemble, and it is a bit tricky, but not difficult if you take your time. And there's two of you to do it. Okay, give it. Push him forward towards us. Turn him towards us. That's it. And uh, now bring. It. What you're doing now is waggling the tail back and forth slightly, and that sort of propels him along. Okay, now if you dip the nose by putting that forward, thing going forward, now he'll come down a bit. Now the tricky bit we found after inflating him was in this little front bit here. Um, you open that up, let's just do that, just like that, and you open this front bit up and you put little bits of putty, and the putty help weigh it to balance it, because it's supposed to stay balanced at about six foot. As you can see now, it's almost almost perfectly balanced. Um, so it's just got the right amount of putty. So Kate, okay, you want to give it a bit of a wander around the room and crash into the Christmas tree? What you really need is a bigger room. There we go, we've crashed into the beam at the top of the ceiling there, but it's just bounced off. I would imagine, looking at some of the sticky bits, that we will have to put a bit more sticky plaster on to hold them on. Because they do seem to be coming a little loose, but there are spares supplied with it in the box. So you can see the tail going back and forth there. Give the tail a bit of waggle cake, there we go. Now 
Don't come straight towards the camera. Here you come. There you go, and that's the end of our air swimmer review.